Fire crews today spent hours on the scene of a massive fire at a Waxahachie recycling plant. Flames appear to be out tonight, but the smoke has the city now looking to ease concerns about air quality in that area. Fair concern. Robbie Owens looking into that in Waxahachie with the latest. It's taken hours, but it appears that the smoke has finally cleared. We've been told that no harmful levels of chemicals were detected. The city asking state and federal authorities to conduct their quality testing as a precaution. The fire at the Oak Cliff Metals recycling plant began burning before daybreak. At around 3 or 4 in the morning, that's when I heard all the ambulances. Fire departments, I think, because I just heard the sirens. Sending thick plumes of dark smoke into the surrounding neighborhoods. I just saw the smoke and uh, I thought it was a, a, a you know, accident 35. What did you think was happening? I didn't know what was happening, but I never thought it was, it was that, a fire again, was... close to us again. A Waxahachie Life Schools campus nearby opted to cancel classes as a precaution. Maybe for safety is okay, yeah. According to Waxahachie City staffers, the Texas Commission on Environmental Quality conducted air quality testing at the ground level. The EPA flew a plane into the ominous plumes to collect samples. I can tell if it was it was burning hard that you could really probably be something really bad in the air. Alex Gutierrez admits to coming closer to get a look, but was relieved to learn that the day-long haze did not spread a harmful level of chemicals. It was a, a huge plume of smoke, but it wasn't reaching where I was. According to the Oak Cliff Metals website, the company collects and recycles, among other things, steel, aluminum, iron, rebar, and copper. No word yet on how the fire may have started. In Waxahachie, Robbie Owens, CBS 11 News.